Fallout New Vegas may be 15 years old, but it still plays really well and has a ton of content for you to enjoy. However, if it's your first time playing it, you may be a bit overwhelmed and you probably have some questions about its older mechanics. So we compiled all the things Fallout New Vegas doesn't tell you so that you can be fully prepared for your adventure. Like I said before, Fallout New Vegas is an older game, so some modern day mechanics don't exist in it. Unfortunately, one of the better things missing is sprinting. While you can't sprint in the game, you kind of glide along at a decent pace anyways, and have the ability to slow down with the shift button to walk and sneak around. You can always install a mod to get sprinting, but unless you do that, don't be surprised you can't move any faster. Fallout New Vegas is an RPG at its core, so this means you can play really however you want. You can build your character to be as strong, silver-tongued, or sneaky as you want. You can decide to side with two different warring people and betray one or both of them, and you can piss off entire factions with one slip of the tongue, or your hands if you're trying to pickpocket. Lean into the role-playing aspect of it and really just become your character and have fun with some of the decisions you make. There's no right or wrong way to play the game. Speaking of decisions, each solution in New Vegas has multiple solutions. So before you get married to the idea of helping someone out the hard way, go around and talk to other NPCs involved in the quest line and see what other possibilities you can come up with. New Vegas has a level cap of 30 in the base game and can go up to 50 with the expansions. The base game actually doesn't have enough skill points to let you max all skills, but with the DLCs, you can actually formulate your points so you can max everything out. If you want to fully level everything, you'll have to go into the wasteland to find skill books and implants to level your special stats to 10. If you're afraid of getting too high of a level too fast with the amount of XP you can earn, you can always select the skilled trait, which gives you plus five to all skills, but you get 10% less XP. This will leave you with a total of 65 points. Unfortunately, Fallout New Vegas doesn't really have romance options. There are no romance quest lines or subplots. If you're really hankering for some lovin', you can actually sleep with various um, hired companions or NPCs you've completed quests for. That doesn't qualify as any sort of romance option though. So if you're wanting to play this game for some steamy romance, you're gonna find out that it's as dry as the Mojave Desert. New Vegas is fairly stingy with the autosaves. You can turn on the option to autosave when you enter or exit a building, but since you're trekking across the desert, those saves are usually not enough. Don't be ashamed to save often. You have no idea when you might get ganged up on by rat scorpions and rapidly lose health and die miles away from your last checkpoint. As many times as your karma notification pops up on your screen, your status doesn't actually really matter. Karma generally won't affect your game since most of the karma-based interactions are with different factions. There are different ending slides for each faction depending on if you had good, neutral, or evil karma with them in their ending quest. Aside from that, karma doesn't really mean too much, so don't be worried about stealing your favorite NPC's food or money stash. Unless they see you, then you're in a real pickle. Once you've finished the main quest line of New Vegas, you won't be able to keep on playing like you usually can in other games. You have to manually save before the last quest, Battle of Hoover Dam, then reload that save if you want to keep playing after finishing the game. So keep that in mind before you run the last quest, in case you want to tidy up some loose ends before rolling credits. And that's all you need to know. Have fun causing chaos in the Mojave Desert. For more Fallout New Vegas tips and tricks, be sure to stay right here at IGN.